Gabriella. Gabriella, real name. Sarah Dolan. And Sarah, who's very reluctant to leave that microphone. Uh, Sarah, um, where are you from exactly? Swatra. Lovely. And have you supporters here tonight? Yes, I do. There's a lot of them actually. Mommy, Daddy, Granny and Granda, Celeste, Jackie and Dee Dee. Holy Lord. The entire row. Yeah. It's as bad as the Hughes's. Uh, and you say you're from Swatra? Are you in the choir right in SWAT? I'm not, but I'm in the school choir. You're in the school choir, but you're not in the SWAT choir. Would, would JB be in the SWAT choir? I don't know. <laughs> Say yes. Yes. Okay. JB's in the SWAT choir. Have you seen JB recently? This is Jim B. Jim B. Sorry, you don't know him as JB. Uh, Jim B is, uh, of course, shaven, or not shaven rather, for uh, the Romanian uh, trip. And as far as I can work out, he looks a wee bit, as I imagine, Santa looks on around the 10th of January. So, you know, he's just given up. He's been in the drink for about a fortnight. He hasn't washed. He's just, oh, leave me alone. You know, doesn't know what time it is. Uh, in fact, I'm fairly sure there's posters in Romania with JB's face on it. You know, just a fiver will shave and wash this man. Judges, what do we think of Gabriella? 
Sarah, that was excellent. I'm glad to see somebody moving about the stage for a change and a wee bit upbeat at music. We've had a couple of real slow ones there and I was starting to fall asleep. Thank you very much. That was very, very well done. He's so nasty, isn't he? I'm trying to bite my tongue, actually. <laughs> this is you being good. Okay, ladies and, ladies and gentlemen, Gabriella Chalmay. Okay, and now another solo act. Please welcome Adele. stage in front of the guts of 400 people is a very, very difficult thing. So you did fantastically well. Please give her a big hand. Well, fantastic job. And who got you to do this? Who talked you into this? Mommy. Good, Mrs McCluskey, another one. And of course, uh, I'm going to put you on the spot and we'll, we'll not tell anybody, but who's the better singer, you or Laura? Me, obviously. Obviously. Ladies and gentlemen, Laura. Okay, hold on to your seats. Act 10, please welcome Christy Moore and Declan Sonnet. November evening. But, uh, Declan and I have travelled the whole way from Newbridge County to Kildare to be with you, so. I don't know why it's just bad. But, uh, we're singing a little song for you this evening called uh, Liston Varna. I don't know if you know it. But, uh, anyway, uh, please feel free to join in the chorus, clap until your heart's content, and uh, without any further ado. Clancy and Noah Hill. There's boots and fiddles everywhere, but music you want. She's taking me in England City and going Claire. Oh, 
everybody needs a break. She'll lay my mouth on her jump at a lake. Some head off to exotic places. Others go to the Galway races. A cousin of mine goes pot polling. A cousin of hers loves Joe Dolan. Maddie goes to the south of France. Jim to the dogs, Peter to the dance. Summer comes around each year. We go there and they come here. Some head off to Frahiliana. But we always go out listen to Varna. <laughs> Thursday night, with a tenth of my ground sheet rolled up tight. I like to hit this doom in around Friday afternoon. This is just time to get my gear together. Don't need to worry about the weather. Ramble in for a pint of stout, cause you never know who'd be hanging about. There's a Dutchman playing a mandolin, the German looking for the Imogo Flanagan, Adam Bono, Jarvis Jerk getting their photo taken for the Sunday world. Finbar, Charlie, Jim, and they're drinking pints to bait the band. Then. Isn't it grand? Jackson Brown had a blues match going just to get him down before the chieftains could start to play. Seven dreamer pints came out in a tray. Sure, Gower was written by Lord Lucan. Sean Cannon played the backstage cooking. Clamor was playing Harry's game and Christy was singing Nancy Spain. Mary O'Hara, Brush Shields, together doing the four green fields. Van, the man, Emmy Lou, moving hearts and Blankety too. in throngs to hear the music in the songs with motorbikes and high ace vans and bottles, barrels, flagons, cans, loads of frolics, pioneers and alcoholics, black spot, the FCA, free and mega jelly in the GAA, hairy chest, milk white thighs, Brendan Rogers in the skies. <laughs> Pierce McGrath, O'Brien's, Pippins, Cox's, massage parlors, horse boxes, RTE or making tapes, taking breaks, throwing shapes. There's Owruns, Bowruns, Lamadorans, Arab Sikhs, Hindu Sheikhs, Jesus freaks. This is heaven, this is hell. Who cares? Who can tell? Anyone from the last two chug eyes is now. <laughs> There is a no drugs or alcohol policy in the school. Are you all right, Mr. Christy Moore? You're willow that, sir. Don't worry. Don't worry, Tom. So there's no point me asking him his name because his name is Christopher Christy Moore. And uh, Declan Sinnott. Christy, who um, would you say are your main, you know, creative influences? No, sure of it. Many creative influences throughout the time, such as uh, Johnny Cash, uh, Bob Dylan, uh, Hugo Duncan, and uh, God himself. <laughs> and uh, Declan, how long have you uh, been involved in music? Well, no, uh, since I was in the womb, probably. Uh, uh, <laughs> Pleasant experience for everybody. And um, is your is your good mother here tonight? 
no, no, Mama, I couldn't make it tonight. No, she, she said, wait at home. <laughs> and um, have you have you any support here tonight, Declan? No. <laughs> You're not meant to laugh. <laughs> Proper awe. <laughs> That's better. And um, lads, uh, how long have you two been um, performing? Uh, well, Master, we've been together since P1. Be been together? No, 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 no. Ladies and gentlemen, Christy Moore and Declan Sinnott. <laughs> Judges, what, what do you think? What a performance. The girls love you. You could be the next boy band. It was fantastic. I've seen you many times, Christy, and I've never seen this. not enough sweat. <laughs> you are far too animated, and it was... I can't believe you got Declan out of Pakistan there, either. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, big hand for Christy Moore and Declan Sinnott. Just give you a while to let that settle in, should I? <laughs> now, Act 11, our second to last act, is again a different Adele!
Adele, what's your real name? Anya. Anya what? Broly. Anya Broly. And uh, any uh, uncles, famous uncles? Joe Broly. Joe Broly. Thank God this girl's much better having a microphone than that man. <laughs> and Anya, you came the whole way back from America for this, is that right? Hi. See that American accent she picked up when she was over there? Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, who would you say, Anya, do you think are uh, the dogs in the competition this evening gone beatly? Be, you know, don't hold, won't hold any punches. Jackie, no. Christy's getting an awful hard time. He's right? back in there now halfway through a bottle of whiskey. It's unbelievable. The other boy, Bono or whoever he was, he's off his head too. Right, <clears throat> judges, what have we got to say about Adele? Very well done, a superb performance, ear reckon just beside the speakers here as well for us and it's a good job you came back from America because that was excellent. I'm really glad you translated that Mr. Don because my German's rubbish. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Adele! Okay, the last act of the evening. Okay, and before I introduce them, a few safety notices. Remain in your seat at all times. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Westlake. Yeah, guess I fail to love 